So initially when I first started watching the trailer for this, I said, possibly maybe I'll watch it. Saw a couple of Afros, big collars, bell bottoms, some really, really good looking ladies in there. And then I said, you know what? Let me look at the cast. And I started to see Kevin Hart, Samuel Jackson, Terrence Howard, Taraji P. Henson, Don Cheadle. Let me really dive deep into this. So today, let's quickly discuss, spoiler free, Fight Night, The Million Dollar Heist. So the description reads, following his return to boxing after dodging the draft, Ali, and we're talking Muhammad Ali, beats Jerry Crary. Later that night, hundreds are robbed at his after party in a massive armed robbery. So family, looking at this, I absolutely was taken back to the 70s, right? I was taken back to seeing the bell bottoms, the afros, and all that good stuff, right? Absolutely taking me back to a time period where that's a lot of black exploitation movies that came out before I was born and even after I was born, right? We're talking Hell Up in Harlem. We're talking Shaft, right? We're talking Dolomite. We're talking movies like that. That absolutely was black exploitation films, but still represented us in sort of way. But there was a lot of pimps and a lot of young ladies of the night in it. But still, we had films and actors back then. They got a lot of work from that. Some of these films actually earned anywhere from half a million to a million dollars in the box office. So these were pretty big films. So looking at this fight night, the million dollar heist, it took me back in the day to when the black exploitation movies were out. So did I enjoy those movies? Yes, I did. I actually did, right? Uh, many of the uh, actors that you may know today, the famous ones that became huge, like Bill Cosby and like Sidney Poitier, they were in movies like that back in the day. So here we are with our modern day actors who are doing tremendous things in Hollywood. We're talking Kevin Hart, Samuel Jackson, Taraji P. Henson, Don Cheadle, Terrence Howard, and an array of massively talented other actors in this film coming together. This is a power packed film. Now, again, we talk about casting, right? Mm, the guy that got for Muhammad Ali, he sounded like him, but no, he didn't really pull it off, but he did a pretty good job. I can say that this heist, the way that it was set up, the way that they executed it, the way that they had no idea who was coming to this party. And once Frank Moten, who was played by Samuel L. Jackson, Terrence Howard shows up, these characters show up and they don't know that these guys are part of the black mafia, all from different parts of the country coming down to Atlanta, because this is based in Atlanta to see this fight by Ali. And he wins, of course. And they don't know that they are robbing the black mafia. <laughs> So now things and the stakes are even higher. They're trying to rob this party, right? Trying to get $20,000, right? That was huge back then. And yes, this was going to be huge for them, those who were robbing the place. So the whole screw up is where they now rob the wrong guys. And things turn upside down when they finally realize who's in the house. They finally realize that these guys are not playing. And not to spoil it, family. Let's just say things get pretty wild. And yes, it was episodic, but absolutely, I enjoyed it. Well written, well scripted, well put together, just back to back action. You never knew what was going to happen next. You never knew that it was inside job as well. And you'll find out exactly what that is and who that is. You got Chloe Bailey in there. You got even Lori Harvey is in this as well. Right. So. There's a whole lot of folks in this film, and I got to say that I was highly entertained. I got to say that your first three episodes probably we could say is the setup episodes of the heist. And then everything else follows after that. It picks up a little bit. We have Ali, Muhammad Ali, dealing with the racist times back then. Right. And uh, being that he won the fight, of course, they weren't happy about that, being that he avoided the draft. Your people down there probably saw him in some type of way. But Ali stood on business and he beat the guy and he went down there and we got the detective who's played by Don Cheadle. And he actually was in charge of protecting Muhammad Ali 
from all the racists and from all the people that was trying to get at him. So this was an action packed film full of superstars, full of Oscar nominated and Oscar winning actors. I'm excited about it. And guess what, family? You might be excited about it, too. So check it out. Fight night. The million dollar heist. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Hit that like button as well. And if this is your first time here, definitely subscribe. Family, this is Fight Night, The Million Dollar Heist. Check it out. Let me know. Until next time. Salute.